what's up everybody um what's up youtube what's up world what's up truckers trucker men trucker gals what's up with you guys um i'm coming to you from the cab of the truck again um i'm here in princeville alabama um we're going through Arkansas, we're going our head into Arkansas, home time. Um, dropping off in um, Jacksonville, Arkansas at its lows. I picked up in Adairsville, um, where I dropped off at. But um, I'm coming to you guys today, just um, let you guys know what's going on, giving you guys a little update. That's about all. But um, actually, I wanted to let you guys know, I just got off the phone with Lone Mount Trucking. I've been doing a lot of research on, well, Lone Mount Truck Leasing. I've been doing a lot of research on that company. It's, it's, they seem very, 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 very legit. Uh, I looked at their reviews and everything. So I just called the guy, um, spoke to one of the salesmen, and... Uh, Asked, asked him a couple of questions about their program, their um, truck leasing program. You know, um, guys, if you ask me, man, that's the best route to go. That what they're offering, you know, it's it's a it's a lease to buy. Um, it's not like what quality offers or a lot of these other leasing companies offer out here. There's not a buyout. There's not a balloon buyout at the end of the term or anything. And they do have used and new trucks, but um, I asked him a couple of questions about, you know, because I was just hypothetically speaking, I asked him about the um, the 2017 W900 or whatever, Kenworth. I'm not saying that's the type of truck that I want, but I was just reference to that truck, and um, there's not interest or anything on the on the, on the lease at all. It just one pot one price um i didn't ask him about any type of negotiating on the um on the tractor but um from the reviews and from what i have seen on their website they saying that it's a one price which i'm knowing that's that's bs because i've been in sales before there's no such thing as a set price everything is negotiable everything is negotiable but um besides that you know i asked him about um the down payment and all that stuff this is what i hit them with right here i'm and i already knew the answer i was like because they re, they require you to put a, a, a um a certain amount of money down on the type of tractor you look at and um on this one that i was looking at in the truck paper it says 9500 down and five um 595 a month or whatever so i was asking him about that truck i said well if if i put that um 9500 down is it going towards the principal of the truck or how, how does that work you know i already knew the answer i said what about the interest or anything he was like well there's not any interest he said we have alleviated all that right there i said okay cool so he said, man, you just put the $9,500 down. That's coming off the principal of the truck. I said, okay, then, cool. I see I see what you guys are saying now. But um, besides that, guys, um, I encourage for the guys that, that that's looking to um, transition into the owner-operator part of the industry and you're looking to, you know, if, you, if you're looking to buy your own truck, I highly recommend Lone Mount Truck Leasing. Um, now they do have used trucks too. They have used and new trucks, but I highly recommend those guys because, um, like I said, man, I've done research on those guys. And before I jump into anything, I do tons of research, and they seem pretty legit. But um. I'm not going to discuss the type of truck. Well, the truck that I'm looking at, I'm going to say this. The truck that I'm looking to buy for myself is a, um, a Freightliner. Not a, 
Um, I'm looking at the Freightliner Coronado. That's the, that's the tractor that I want for myself, for my business. That's what I'm looking at. And I also asked the, the, the salesman about, um, well, I was like, well, what if I was wanting to, um, can I lease this, this tractor in my business name? And he was like, sure. But it was a catch to it. He was like, you can do that, but right out the gate, they don't suggest that. They suggest that you um, lease it in your own name. And he also said, he said, after you lease it in your own name for about six months, he said, you can talk to the account, the accounting people here. And six months on down the line, you can um, put everything else into your company name. I said, okay, that sounds good. But um, he answered all my questions that I was after, and um, he didn't sugarcoat anything. I can say I can say that I can assure you of that. But um, this video is a little long, six minutes right now. But um, like I said, I just want to give you guys an update, uh, fill you guys in about some information that I had um collected today from Lone Mount Truck Leasing. As I said, man, they seem pretty legit, guys. And I um, mean, if you're looking to make that transition into um, getting your own tractor, well, buying your own tractor, not um, not just um, renting a tractor, as I, that's what I say, renting one, when you go to one of these places like Quality or whatever. But um, I highly recommend Lone Mount Truck Leasing, guys. But um, this is all I have for you guys. Um, I'm not going to take too much more of your time. You guys be blessed and um, be safe out there. And uh, like I said, man, I'll be giving you guys more updates with me and everything. And uh, peace.